Let's go, baby. The guy who wrote this game is the same guy who copy strike PewDiePie for the bridge incident, by the way. Wait, that's awesome. Game one. Episode one. A new day. Continue. Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and... Well, yeah. We're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order I of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. We can do some polls for hard choices, chat. We're, I'm down to do that. All right. Fucking Glenn is going to help me, I hope, because, like, I need to unlock the door. I need to be able to unlock the door, because, remember, we're locked in here, okay? How you doing, Glenn? We got to yeah. unlock the front door so we can get the brick and also go to my brother's dead zomber body. Back to the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess. But that's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Good, man. Good. I guess you really wanted that gun. Seems like. Why didn't you tell Carly to just give it to her? <clears throat> Would you have given it to her? No way. Then you know why. I'm a murderer, by the way. <laughs> Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? Oh, you know, I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Try to get some rest. Huh. Yeah, right. Should I give... I feel like I want to give an energy food to Glenn, honestly. Okay, so we're going to break the lock. Uh, okay. I'm pretty sure we're going to break the lock by, uh, by using the axe on it. Which, I don't even know how you can break a lock with the axe, but... story of the century here huh yeah and i've got shit for recording equipment and from the looks of it there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts you do radio that's right well until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding and i hit the blogosphere i better get back to it <laughs> yep oh it's so 2010 thanks by the way don't mention it just remember what i said yeah i will The blogosphere. Yo, that shit is funny as hell, dude. All right, let's get the fuck out of here, doing? Doug. Good. Let's go, Doug. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's go, Dougie Doug, you son of a bitch, you big dick bandit, you, let's you motherfucker. Okay. She can join TYT? Yeah. Douglas. I'm going to break this. Awesome. Awesome. Douglas, things. you were afraid beforehand. Carefully. I can't reach that brick. Wait, what? Why can't I? Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. <clears throat> there are so many outside. Holy shit. Why are they going now? Because we have to open the door and fucking. We have to we have to get to my brother who's a zomber. <clears throat> a few seconds of searching and we'll know if he has the keys. Wait, I can't get there? Wait, why can't I just walk there? I'm so confused. Oh, 
I can just like toss a fucking brick there. I have one brick, one opportunity. Opportunity comes once in a Those lifetime. TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Oh, I gotta break the glass. Let's go. Chuck it. Let's go. Be a legend. Be a legend. Be a legend. Be a legend. Let's go, dude. All the zombies are gonna focus on the TVs now. <laughs> Guys, this is a this is consumer culture, by the way. You know, this is we're now all mindless. We're all mindless drones, aren't we? Looking at TV. Looking at the TV, man. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? That's a metaphor for American TV consumers type shit. If you think about it, aren't we the walking dead? Bro, 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 he's making noise, bro. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but Bro, he I is entirely too confident. You would have died for them. So uh, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give Stop me a yelling, second. dumbass. What the fuck, Doug? Sorry, I wasn't here. But knowing you were to take care of him through all of it, that helped. Am I gonna cut his head off? I have to, right? I can't get into his pockets without it. Do it, bro. Do it again, do it again. Quick, 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 quick before the zombies come. Come on. More, 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 more. Cut his head. Chop his head off. Chop his head off. Chop his head off. Bro, I'm gonna look up and they're gonna be there fucking looking right at me. Wait, was I missing? There we go. Holy crap! Run! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're so fucking cooked, bro. We're so fucking cooked, bro. Oh my god. Lock it. Lock it. Doug. Doug, Doug. <laughs> we can't go Man, out that route. Close. But we did it. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's oh, get in. Oh, am I? Wait a minute. Maybe I can riz her up now. Now that we know Carly is only interested in Doug. Fucking bitch ass Doug. This music is kind of fire. Can't believe I lost the fucking IT guy over here. Fucking Doug Doug ass. Oh no. Oh, shit. We gotta hurry. Wait, what? What? The cops are gonna come? What the fuck do you mean we gotta hurry? Oh my god, that's mom and dad, isn't it? Oh my god, that's fucked up. Is that mom and dad? No shot. I hope that's not mom and dad. Time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you Bro. go. Guys, that door's not locked anymore. He is the. He Shit. is. You I'm locked in. I'm locked I'll in. You know who else locked in? Fucking Kenny, dog. Stay away from the windows. 
Kenny is fucking locked in. He is Giga Chad. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Elite. Am I supposed to? If we don't make it through this. You should know that I think you're a great guy. Shut the fuck up, Doug. We will make it through this. Doug, I should have said shut the fuck up. This, you should know. <laughs> oh no, don't I say should it. know what? Huh? You said I don't should say know. It. Don't say it. Don't you say Honey. those words, Carly. Are you sure? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh my gosh, he almost popped Doug. Come in, Ty. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Come in, Ty. Did you find anything? Nothing. Oh, wait. The window is screwed. Go. Dude, it's so hard to do this. I found something. It's so hard to do QTE with this. Oh my god, Pappy's. No. Pappy's can. No. 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 Oh, no. oh, no. oh fuck. What, your purse? Oh, she needs ammo from the purse. Okay, ammo from the purse first. Ammo from the purse first. We can save Doug with the weapon. And if Doug dies, then I'm honestly not going to be sad, to be honest. Sorry, Carly's got a gun. Carly's got a gun. Carly's got a gun. Pop him. Let's go. Pop him. Get him off go me. get Doug. Go get ah. Doug. Ah. 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 Oh my God. Let's go. Okay, I see that. Can you hate me for that? Really? Are we going to hate on me for that choice? I'm sorry. Smoking on that fucking dead op pack, bro. Dead Doug. Oh, smoke him. Carly's mine now. Let's fucking go, baby. Let's go. Also, she has a gun. Like, I'm crab dancing on his dead zomber body, okay? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, you didn't save the nerd. You didn't save the fat nerd. Like, shut up, chat. I'm making money moves, okay? Not funny moves up in here. Shut the fuck up. They got Doug. They, they, Sim you got him. That's not a simple choice at all, chat. You're dumb. Run. You're not coming with this, you son of a bitch. Are no. you fucking serious? Oh my god, I'm killing Larry. I'm killing Larry. I'm killing Larry. I should have never gotten that piece of shit. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Especially a good friend. Fucking piece of shit, Larold. I fucking hate you, you scumbag. You fucking piece of shit, you son of a bitch. Cocksucking motherfucker. I hope you fucking die. You were supposed to die. Science kept you alive, you piece of shit. Fuck you, dude. I'm killing Larry next. It's on site, okay? You understand me? The moment that I have an opportunity to use Larry as fucking bacon against these mindless zombies. I like zombies more than I like Larry because zombies at least take care of my enemies when I feel like it, like Doug. Larry, on the other hand, just a perennial L. Oh, man. Clementine. Should have been you, Larry, and not Doug. I like that we don't even give a shit that Doug died, by the way. Like, we don't give a fuck. Nobody collectively cares that Doug died, except for maybe Carly, but she'll get over it. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. Bro, you're out of your fucking mind, dude. What friends? Your friends are zombies now, bro. You're fucking crazy. Actually crazy. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Can you just look over there? 
Everything we own would be lost if I left TV show friends? Oh, this is from The Walking Dead? not like we have much to begin with. I didn't watch the TV show. I might watch it after this game, so don't ruin it for me, please. Can I stop him? I don't know if I can stop him. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Read the comic instead. Can you just look over there? Everything we own would be lost if I left you alone for five minutes. I don't know how hard it is to keep track of things. It's not like we have much to begin with. I remember when I packed them up, I said, Yeah, main character of The Walking Dead is the Austin show, right? Like, gotta support my boy Austin on his fucking TV. On his pivotal TV role, you know? Did you check the glove oh my god, Duck, shut the fuck hey, up, stupid. Close call back there. Thanks fuck. for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. So awesome. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. That's why I was so good as a murderer, Kenny. I'm just, oh fuck, did I say that out loud? Oh, I'm sorry. I have the Japanese disease. I can't stop yapping about my murder that I committed, which I was on the way to be prosecuted for and jailed, imprisoned permanently for. Oops, somehow that's a dialogue option. How did that get there? How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know, it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. I'm sorry, Carl. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. He hated you, Carly. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. You had the gun, Carly. Also, you're sexy. I just sexy. wish we both could have made I it. I want you. I need you in my bones, Carly. Carlito. Pay attention to where you leave things. Oh man, check this out. The Jumatron had this mini gun on his shoulder. Oh man, check this out. The Jumatron had this mini gun on his shoulder. It's all like pow, pow, pow. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. <laughs> it's. <laughs> He's like, I'm sorry you're stuck with whack-ass duck who won't shut the fuck up. It's so funny. <laughs> He's like, Clementine, I'm so sorry. that The only motherfucker you're trapped in here was duck. I know that you want to jump to the next zombie to kill you so you never have to hear his yapping again. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. I swear I saw it earlier. You never pay attention to oh, me. I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be yeah. tough. Can you just look I'm just over sad. Everything I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how minutes. I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. Things. It's gone. Like we have much Maybe we can with. find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. I remember when I packed Lee, up, I said, come here for a second. Oh, these are going <laughs> Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Dude. Clementine, another thing. Oh my god, bro. You like my daughter? Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. 
and you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit As racially motivated. But if anything happens... As racially motivated. He, he literally doesn't even know. He's just confusing me with another black man. As fucked up. Chat, listen. I'm not Lee Everett, okay? It's just... <laughs> listen. Listen. He's just being racist, okay? He just thinks... Yeah, he's just he's just doing it. He's just you know a fucking racist piece of shit. Okay. Thanks to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, bro has the fucking phenotype of a dude who does follow the black crime tab at Breitbart. You know what I mean? How else does he know? Each. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were up to date on every murder that a black man has committed in the fucking state of Georgia, you know what I mean? You know his ass is on the black crime tab every day, refreshing. Racist. Much worse than murdering my wife, or the senator that fucked my wife. Do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Bro, who did the voice acting for her? It's like, it sounds like AI. Oh my god, we spoke too soon, huh? Classic. Wait, what do you mean next time on The Walking Dead? Is that the first season? Is that the first game? Is it over? I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Was that the first game? Oh, their episodes. This is the first episode. How can I skip this? Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In I case you or Clementine it. starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. I can't skip it, Jazz. Shut up. I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's oh, beautiful. more races. Great. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fucked with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Yeah! Ah! 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 You never liked my dad. Even back at the drugstore when everyone thought Kenny's kid was bit, you went out of your way to side against him. This isn't happening. <laughs> no more, please. No more, please. How many... Don't spoil please, anything. Please. How many... How many episodes are in this first season? Chat, how many episodes are in this first season? Five? Okay. Um, I didn't pay attention to anything that was going on in an effort to be... Oh, shit. You and 54% were honest to Lee? Lied to Herschel. <laughs> Who would you save, Duck or Sean? 52% of players chose Doug. Loyalty. You and 54% of players defended Kenny. Mercy gave Irene the gun. You and 53% of players refused to give her the gun. You and 49%? Oh my god, gamers are fucking incest, bro. Or not incest, sorry, incels. They Gamers all saved Doug? 51% saved Doug? I swear to god, gamers are such fucking sweaty losers, bro. That, that's gotta be woman bad, right? There's no other reason. She had a gun. 
Yeah, Carly sucks. I get it because she doesn't fuck me. I, I got it. Okay. How do I skip this? Trusted with gum, but not batteries. I don't give a fuck. She knows how to pop heads, bro. That's what matters. That's that's what matters more than anyone else. No, it won't let you. Come on. What the fuck? No, you can't escape. Escape just puts you on fucking. Do I exit game or no main menu? And then start on episode two. Miss Seeker sex ending. I know who you are. I got another good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. Bro, this has got, got more it. recaps than a and fucking One Piece okay, episode, Carly. dude. You'll what shift the hell? in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. This has got, this is One Piece style shit. Like, unacceptable level of recapping here. Come on. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Oh, don't relive oh my, my glory I don't again. I shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Smoking on that dog pack. Let's go. Fucking dude. Yeah, dude, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but like... Doug deserved the smoke, okay? He came after my woman like that. I'm sorry that it had to work out that way, but it really did. Lerald is next, by the way. Oh my God, I can't wait to make a choice that kills Larry. Oh my God. Am I playing this game right? I feel like I'm playing this game wrong. Three months later, I'm dripped out. I'm popping zombies in the head like it's nobody's business. Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. Bro, how is there fucking recaps? Fucking uh, up next on season two ass fucking... 20 minutes of like shit that I haven't seen yet. Spoilers. And another 20 minutes of recaps. And I have no idea who the fuck this guy is. It's like, are you deliberately making this confusing? That's crazy. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me. I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Who's Lily? You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having a lot of daughter out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? 
How is Larry still alive, bro? It's been three months. It's been three whole goddamn months, and I still haven't won seemingly pipe Carly, which is a big L, and Larry is still alive. I haven't even fucked Larry's daughter. The only reason why Larry should still be alive is if I want to fuck his daughter so he gets extra raises and then kills himself. Okay? That's crazy. Three months, bro? You have no riz. You have no risk. Thank God I'm fucking controlling this character again. Holy shit. Larry's been doing yoga to spite you. He's just an old racist asshole. That's his deal. Yeah. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Heart problems are yeah. not. We should all be out here trying to find food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. He did. He did knock me flat. Fucking. White supremacist piece of shit. Take the shot. We need anything we can get at this point. Fuck that burb. Bro, you fucking L nerd. Shit. Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. You suck, bro. You missed the bird. Did the bullet shoot Kenny instead? Like, what the fuck just happened? Ah! Yo, ain't no way we shot Kenny. Ain't no fucking way, bro. Oh. Jesus Christ. Okay, m never oh, mind. Shit. It's not Kenny. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not going to hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you got to shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We've got to help him. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just <laughs> see if you can get him out. After Classic. that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. I'm ROTC. we got to get him out of there. Oh, God, thank you. Fine, but you got to hurry. Hurry, please, hurry. Oh, they're coming. Zomber's coming. Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. We gotta chop his leg off, baby. Oh, no. We gotta chop Shit. it off. Walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please! Chop it off. Get me out of this. Chop Bob, it off. Get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Damn it, this is bad. Really bad. Oh fuck, why am I looking? Oh, please. All that blood and screaming? We're gonna please, be surrounded any something. minute. Please! Get me out of please. this! Please! You can't just leave him like this! Maybe chop this? Try to cut the chain! Is he, hurry. Is he gonna make it? Uh, oh man! Let's go! Oh, let's man. go! It's not where I don't think it's working. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Come on! What Try the fuck is this thing? thing. Uh, Lee, it has to be now. Do you think you can get it open? Uh, please hurry, bro. I'm gonna have to chop your leg Damn off, it, big Lee, dog. Sorry. Leg. We don't have time for that. I'm sorry, but we have to go now. No, no, no. Try the trap again. Anything, please. Sorry, big dog. The leg's getting out. Uh, Lee, I can't keep him back forever. Sorry, big dog. Uh, yep. You're gonna be Fuck, legless I'm now. Ammo now. We gotta go. Oh god, there's so many of them. Ah, one more. Did that work? Oh shit! Oh shit! He passed out, bro. Is he? He passed out. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. I 
I tried my best. There's a tourniquet on his leg already. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on. We got to move. <laughs> Run, dumbass. I thought your father was special forces. Oh, he's so dead. He's so eaten. All right, good. At least they got... All right, no! they, got, they got someone else to pay attention to now. Dumbass. Fucking... Oh, my father. I was in the ROTC. Like, fucking dumb fuck. Guess what, dude? You're dead now, so... Yeah, what happened to your epigenetic special forces memories didn't work there, did it? <laughs> you don't have to be fast. You just have to not be the slowest. You know what I'm saying? Guess he didn't. Guess he failed the walking course of the special forces camp. What is Larry doing, bro? He's just fucking hammering a rock. I hate him. I hate him so much. You know this game is not going to let me kill him easy, too. Fuck, man. Get the Don't gates be... open! We've got wounded! <laughs> Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's, What's going on? I don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat! Okay? Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here! What are you thinking? Oh my hey, god, they're so antagonistic. Hey, no, your mouth. I don't! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Bro, she sucks too. I mean, I'll st I, I'd still pipe. Like, don't get me wrong. You know what I mean? Just like at the top of the hour, there's a three-minute ad break, and it's going to happen no matter what. Like, this will happen, specifically because her dad's racist. Okay, I can fix her. But she is fucking annoying, just like her dad, bro. Jesus Christ, both of them are racist. Straight up. Straight up. Oh my god. Guys, you don't understand. It's anti-racist. It's literally anti-racist. Me having sex with her would be anti-racist because the dad would get really mad and then kill himself. That's the goal here. Speed Racer, thank you for the five community to give this up. allowing five people to no longer see the ads at the top of the hour. Okay. Yeah, we're trying to do a little bit of white replacement open here, dude. It's the end of times. Like, you're going to be fucking... I didn't realize that a community of... Oh yeah, that's right. You guys do hate LeBron. So I do have a community of fucking white supremacists out here oh my god oh don't do it don't do great replacement to the whites at the end times like yeah i am thank you i'm reversing dr Jakob's mistake exactly here's the three minute break now yeah he would have died if we left him so what we are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right now. What? That's fucked up, dude. That's actually fucked up. Guyana Grown, think of the five gifted subs. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. What? No, <laughs> I. Just Yo, shut on, the fuck okay? up, dude. You, you like have no choice in the matter. You better look at Clementine's drawings right now, bitch. I didn't save your stupid ass so you would fucking sit around and not look at Clementine's drawings, you motherfucker. But we can make our own goddamn decisions. Be grateful. Decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. 
Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. You're a lunch lady, babe. <laughs> fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Oh my Dad, God, I can't please. wait. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? God, he sucks so bad, you racist monster. I can't wait for you to die, bro. I cannot wait, bro. I can't you wait for the Zombers if to attack. If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. Ain't no way that's the only food we have that's in the backpack. That's all the food we have for today. Ain't no fucking you way. You gets to eat. Well, no, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. Yeah, I'm giving it all to Clem. Fuck this. You have four food items for 10 hungry uh, people. Yeah, Clem gets it all, bro. Clem gets four. Duck is not eating. Let me tell you, you know who's not eating? Daddy. Daddy racist over here, okay? Mr. Klansman. If you think you're getting a fucking piece of Lunchables, you're out of your god dang mind. Okay? Starve. Fuck face. All right, I'll talk to everybody to see who deserves okay. it the most. I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. <laughs> I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. It's what your husband well, wanted? What the fuck? sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Oh my god, bro. I can't wait to wield this newfound power for absolute evil. You know what I'm saying? If you think I'm going to be nice about this food supply shit, you're out of your god dang mind, okay? It keeps the walkers out. Carly's been doing the bulk of the lookout duty. I'm I'm Will straight you up. Hold the damn board steady. I'm trying. I I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Ah, oh, I got sixty cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Oh my God, I hate him. I hate him so much. On my life, there is not a person I hate on this planet more than him right now. Hey, oh my God. You holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there, having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kaja can save him. Like. Racist old man, you need medicine to survive. That's a L. Your heart has given up. Even your heart's not in it. Shut the fuck up. Call them motherfuckers pansies, bro. Oh my God. I would literally substitute his pills for Skittles as soon as I could, okay? Jesus Christ, bro. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Classic chair force, by the way. Uh, I'm too tired. Uh, there aren't children that I can drone strike today. <laughs> I'm at my limit for drone striking children today. Nerd. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen. I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. He is tired, though. 
I feel like I need some allies in this battle. Here, eat something. Wait, I thought I had four pieces of food. What the fuck? You got you an apple. Wow. Thanks a lot. That's that's awesome. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Nah. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Shut the Come fuck on, up, man. old man. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? Is that what you told him? There, yeah, that's right. And what are you going to do about it? Look, I don't care what it is. Uh -huh. You two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. I didn't even deny it, bro. I said, yeah, bum. What's up? What's up? He is racist. See, he didn't even deny it. He's like, yeah. What's up? I am racist. Fuck you. Piece of shit. Ain't no way I'm giving this food to Larry. I'm going to flex on him. Want some food? Just kidding. You've got to talk to Lily about getting along with Kenny. Lily can make her own friends. It's not about making friends. We're all in this together. We got to start acting like it. Uh, stuff all that. We'd be fine without you. Bro, white people, white people in, in the end of time still won't drop racism. You see that? He didn't even fucking deny it. He was like, yeah, I am racist. What are you going to do about a bitch? Lily thinks we should throw these new people out. Damn right. There's too many people hanging around here as it is. Want some Keep food? on that fence. Don't tell me what to do, Lee. <laughs> yeah, I don't get told off by your kind looking ass. Bro, he is so... It's true. At he is racist. The kids have something to keep them occupied. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I oh promise. my God! If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Hey, is new my guy. friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So who are you people? <laughs> Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Ben Parker, Paul, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the terrible name when when everything happened. Playoffs for what band? How are you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know, some kind of I don't know something. Two first names, you can't trust them. I'm sure you did all you could. Yeah, maybe. I'm not going to forget Relax. that. We'll get your friend back to normal. Lee no won't time. forget this, I that sure he has two so. first names. Oh, God, I don't even want to do this right now. How you doing, Duck? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog. Nope. Oh, come on, Ben. You oh, didn't even know. try it's hard. Dog, right? no. Duck, you're a fucking idiot. Oh, my God. You're so stupid, Duck. You were pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. God damn, Catch he's dumb, later, bro. Duck. Bye, Lee. Duck's not even drawing nothing. He's got, like... He's got, like, the, the schizophrenic drawings, bro. Do you see that? He's just scribbling on that paper with fucking... Viciousness. Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Drugstore? Yeah. 
Bro, if you think I'm giving Doug food, you're out of your fucking mind, okay? I need him to shut the fuck up. I don't need him to be energized. I'm hoping that if he doesn't get any food, maybe he'll be tired, okay? You're out of your fucking mind. You saw how fucking angrily he's scribbling on that piece of paper? His ass is like, give me a fucking Lunchable meat and I will keep going for years, okay? I will never shut up. I'll tell you all about dinosaurs and shit. Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food, even though that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you, if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food, too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. If you think I'm going to give Thanks, Larry Charlie. a piece of food, you're out of your goddamn mind, okay? On Autism Awareness Month, too? Come on, bro. I can't believe you're, Back you're, you're owning... You're owning Doug as autistic. That's crazy. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Okay, well, now I don't need to give you food then, because you already gave it to me. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. You I ain't getting no is. food, Kenny. I'm Dumb taking fuck. my family. All right. I am going with him. Should I give him a piece of food? Fuck, he's going to want to give it to his stupid fucking son, though. I'm giving one to Clementine for sure. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, Fuck no. Why don't we didn't get some food. Bro, I do actually feel kind of bad. I'm not gonna lie, I do feel kind of bad about... I just, I don't want to give him food. Fuck Duck. Duck can suck my... Well, no, because he's a child, but fucking he can die, okay? Gotcha, here, here you go. Eat something. Why don't you give it to Duck? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Fucking... I need space, Lee. God damn, everybody's saying feed Duck. Everybody's saying you gotta feed Duck, and I just ugh, don't want to feed him. He's so fucking annoying, bro. Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. I know Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. But this is a good spot. We're protected, we're close to the drugstore, we have a routine now, and it's working. For now. We should talk about you and Kenny. What about us? The arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here, and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. Oh, okay. Got it. Keep Dumbass. Fine. Oh, fuck. God damn it, dude. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Here. Yeah! Oh, man, I'm so hungry. I feel bad, bro. Someone in the chat said, don't be like the IDF. Give Doug food. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. I can't tell who else is hungry. Maybe Lily? Here. 
I don't want anything from you. Take it anyway. You need to eat. This doesn't change anything. It's like I'm still a racist bitch. Well, that's it. Not such an easy job, is it? Bro, I really thought the food the, I really thought the cracker game was gonna actually work. I'm not kidding. I really thought. Bro, worst choice? Wait, what? Elriz, I just lost because she's racist. And the other lady also, Carly hates me too. Look at her. Look at her giving me the side eye. Fuck, bro. It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice. But you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? Oh, you There's think you left. got food? You keep treating people <laughs> like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. I'm trying to get yeah. you to die, well, Larry. Larry, get the message, bitch. I want you dead. I want your ideas to die, too, because you are a white supremacist. But I definitely want you dead in general. I hate you. Eat shit and die. I hope your pills run out, you fucking piece are of you shit. you working on that wall? Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. No! God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, I killed his ass. No problem anymore. What about the other kid? Ah! Oh, what the fuck? He got bit! He got bit! He got fucking bit, dude! Fuck you! Wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, I gotta hit. Oh, I gotta slam it like that? Move, move! Shit, it's stuck. Oh, you suck so much ass, bro. You suck so much ass, bro. God damn it, bro. You fucking chair force scumbag. Kill his ass, bro. Kill his ass. Shoot it. God damn, son. Okay? I brought a fucking zomber yeah. back to camp. Thanks. This sucks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. Wait, what? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. Wait, what? We're all infected? Everyone? I I guess so. I don't know. I all I know is Wait, what I've the seen fuck? people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen. We were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were fine. Bro, I'm not even kidding. I literally thought that that was the case. So, <gasps> when Larry's fucking pills run out, I get to cave his skull in? Let's go, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, sweet victory. Oh, my God. I am going to poke holes in his skull to drink the blood of my other enemies from it. Oh, my Lord. I get to kill him twice? Sweet victory. This is called silver linings, okay?
is called Silver Linings Chat. Finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If Y'all be willing to lower your guns. We we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? That's racist as hell. We got plenty. That's right. Do oh, they sound racist as hell, bro? Oh my god, that's so sus. All right, we got a dairy farm where we definitely don't do white supremacist activities. Get the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. You need to stop sleeping on Carly. She's the goat. No, I know so she's the goat. This dairy. You guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Damn, these guys are... Bro, okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Racist, though, like the fucking preppers, like, they're kind of goaded at this shit. You know what I mean? They're like... Think about it this way. They already think, like, every non-white person is like a zombie literally right now when there isn't like uh some kind of catastrophic event taking place so they're prepped for this like from day one you know what i mean kill them and take over the farm yeah no i'm i'm that's what i'm planning on doing i also have to pee real quick don't praise the preppers honestly if the fucking if doomsday happens i would praise the preppers and then i would kill them and then take over their farm, but I do have to pee. Hold on one second. Hold on a moment now. I'll be back. Uh. Now hold on a god dang minute. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You know, it seems like just yesterday I was You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? 
It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. Bro, is she gonna... I mean, thank are God we gonna sex so or what? Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Oh my God, bro. They're racist. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in the... Who's running things over there? We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food and... Quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mom's okay, these guys are going to eat us, bro. As long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who Calm raided down. my You're camp. Who oh, are they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it there's all for yourselves. Oh no, there's Yeah, and you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! <gasps> Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole! world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Can't wait to do that to Larry, bro. I just saw a snapshot of my future, you know what I mean? Larry's about to get the smoke. Yo, get the crossbow, son. What are you doing? These guys have no survival instinct, bro. That's like perfect crossbow, silent killer. Here it is. Saint That's John insane that day. they let that go. That's insane. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. Bro, they look so incestuous, dude. They look like an incest family. Straight up. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old... I also don't see any zombers on the fucking wall, so either they're eating the zombies after they fry them, or they're eating people. Farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? I've got things under control over there. Well, I hope you know what you're doing. That place isn't safe like it is here. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh, yeah, um, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's Dude, that right. is... Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. 
Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. Bro, they're It'll eating. Be nice to have they're some eating humans. Help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? They're eating humans. Why the bandits are the good guys. One hundo p. For the trip over here. Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See ben? In Leaving her with fucking Mark, nerdy Lee, ass Ben? Why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got too nice, bro. And that fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? <sighs> before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working. You are you so see. dumb, bro. Okay, why is it that goofy motherfucker, bro? This game is too realistic. I swear to God, bro. How did you pass the ASVAB with that? No, man. They're eating people, okay? They're eating people. It's not the broken swing that I'm afraid of. Motherfucker's like, wow, there's an OSHA violations happening everywhere here. Oh. Checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Ooh, we're about to be eating, big dog. Oh my god, I'm looking at the swing. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Yeah, this is, uh, this is real weight pulling by fixing the fucking dumbass swing. God damn it. I can't believe I was... I can't believe they're stupid enough to believe that I was leading this group. Okay. Oh my god. Maybe they're not eating people. No, they are eating people for sure. Let's be real. Big priority here. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? This place was my daddy's life. Meant everything to him. You know, when he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after Dan. My folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of Daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. Bro, I cannot, uh, dude, I do not trust these dudes. I do not trust these incestuous looking freaks, bro. No shot. He's like following me along like a shadow too. Perfect for the swing. Yeah, I'm, I'm really, I'm really pulling my way here with the swing operations, you know? That rope is also good to fucking mm, hang one of the children. Herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. Yeah, fresh herbs to use inside of the fucking humans, dude. We're dinner. Wait, what did I say that you guys are saying, huh? I'm hanging the fucking kids. Like the, the, the incest kids. Not not duck, even though duck Boy. could get it too. Wow, he's really doing a great job surveilling the it's scene here. It's too big right now, but if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a good seat for the swing. 
Hmm. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. How would I prepare human meat? Very carefully. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Wonder how much food they've got in there. Hopefully we'll find out. Hi. I'm suss you out. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. <laughs> yeah, moved on to our bellies, dude. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Uh, like us. Where's Max? Where's Max, bro? All right, I'm gonna go inside I'm the house first before I fix the me. perimeter. Okay, well, we gotta secure the perimeter, so don't take too long. I'm gonna fix that stupid ass fucking swing too. Wait, let me talk to Mark. Let's get his so assessment of the situation. Out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? The fence is no joke, at least around the house. I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of it. I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. So one of the just said, man, I would not last a week without internet. Bro, you would have so much work, dude. You know the amount of fucking work that's constantly required to maintain a plantation style home like this in the midst of a goddamn zomber apocalypse? Right. Don't worry, you this you'd be keeping be busy. Tough. You would not have time for the internet. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh, my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Why are they so Ohio coded? Oh, my God. I just found out pressing shift. Thanks to that one chatter makes you walk faster. We're cooking, boys. Come on now. Giddy up. Paula Dean is going to cook you. Oh, 100%. Maybe her racism will stop her from eating me, though. You know what I mean? Well, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these Sus. days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Sus. Sus. Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Let well, me in the house, up. woman. Now, aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. 
What happened to the rest of you, staff? We oh, ate him. We've had our share of tragedy here, just like everyone else, I'm sure. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night those things showed up here. It was oh, a tough night. How many rooms does this house have? Rooms? Why do you ask? It looks custom built. Nice of you to notice. My husband put a lot of work into this old house. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, now I'm being sus. You know what I mean? Like, random dude shows up at your front door. Was invited, but it's like, how many rooms does your house have? When I kill you and take over your house, I would like to know. Well, he did a fantastic job. It's like I'm doing a fucking Zillow appraisal. I believe in making a house a home. When will dinner be ready? It'd be a while still, but it'd be worth it. Trust me. How's your family been holding up since, uh, you know? All my boys have been my saving grace. They both left their jobs and came home to help out after the attack started happening. I think it was hardest on Andy. Dan was always more of a mama's boy. But don't tell him I said that. <laughs> well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Bro, this is 2010. That house is worth, like, right after the fucking, right after the market crash, like two years after, that house is worth, like, a cool 250 if at that. You know what I mean? Press a space bar. What does that do? Hi. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Oh, bro, it's a big-ass property. Holy shit. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay, if we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what <laughs> it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Uh -huh. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. I mean, you did admit it right to his face. I try to be civil, at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. Never mind. He's based, bro. He's like, listen, I'm a based anti-white. I mean, I'm a based anti-racist activist. Okay. None, no half measures. You know what I mean? He's like, no half measures. No fucking dancing around the issue. There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Disgusting. Never know, we might use it. Was. Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Eh, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food. 
but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth <laughs> of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. <clears throat> I didn't check this one if he's alive or not. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. God damn. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Right Thanks after that? Earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Just try to focus on the task. They knew what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> oh god, they're coming, and we're keeping him there. Little help here, Lee? If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. The zombies are coming in when we're on the other side, bro. One hundo P. Trust. It's gonna come alive, bro. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Uh, uh, I told you what would happen, you son of a What the hell? Get to the gate. Get down! You asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. You got lucky that time. Give us the food. Get closer. Come on out. We don't Lee, know you. Get back here. Did you really think you can fuck with us? You assholes. Fuck. It ain't right. Get we down. We got a deal. Fuck. I see him. Oh, now I can push it. Come on now. I can't push the tractor. What the fuck? Over there. I already got one of you. We had an agreement. We should have picked up the fucking crossbow, bro. Fucking thing. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah, the the shit, move. that hurts. I see ya. Oh my god. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, bro. Race is fucking hicks, dude. God damn it. Everywhere. I can do this all day. What happened? Oh, shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna Did have you to really move think it. You what about all arrangements? Think I can't see ya. Uh, try to lure me in the open. Uh, uh, try to lure me in the open. What do they got? Get Unlimited crossbow ammo? Much. What the fuck's going on? Oh, another dead. Another dead in the way. Get God damn it. Food. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Food, you I see this him. one's alive, probably. One of them's gonna Get be alive. Oh, told you. Told you. Told you was bound to be alive. Oh my god. You okay? Yo, throw him at the fucking throw him at the wall, son. He's right there. He's coming after us. Now we're gonna take 
Wait, what? What the fuck? Wait, I thought... Was I supposed to kill him? Where's our food, you asshole? Another one? How many of those things did Give we push down? Food. That was the first time I died. Look at that. Over there. Now there you are. Did I not run fast oh, enough, Chad? What happened? Or am I supposed to deal with it? Okay. Yeah. Uh, barely. Come on. Now we're gonna the gate's right there. I thought if I was in front of the tractor, I'd get fucking caught by the you goddamn uh, crossbows. I was wrong, I guess. Did you really think you could fuck with us? Damn, they accidentally killed the zomber. Let's get out of here. You lucky sons of bitches. Go ahead and run. We ain't going nowhere. They left the door open, though. They left the door What's open. Uh, 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 there was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Uh, bandits here? On our property? Uh, oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out, but goddamn it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna <laughs> yeah. be okay? He got he got shot with an he got shot with an arrow is so obvious like yeah no shit he's not all right and he got fucking shot with an arrow took an arrow to the goddamn knee just like you're taking a ad break at the top of the hour to the goddamn face unless you're subscribed now let me tell you folks at the top of the hour is streaming ad break if you no longer want to see them ads all you need to do is subscribe for five dollars or for free with a Twitch Prime. By connecting your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch, you're going to get one free Prime subscription a month. Everybody deserves to watch this uninterrupted. House and Ivy Gaming right here, folks. You already know. You already know. Raise hell and praise Dale, folks. Lily the Chaos God, thank you for the five gifted subs. Allowing five people to no longer see the ads at the top of the hour. Yeah, I'm fine. I should Sorry. just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Yeah, what? she'll sort Must you out all right. What kind of shit is this? We Why ran into some people on the way up here. <sighs> Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out. Oh, dude, they're definitely not nice. Okay, Larry has the worst, has the worst radar, bro. If Larry likes them, oh my god, I can't wait to make a deal with the big mama. To be like, yeah, you can eat this fat one, okay? He's got a lot of meat, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Big Mama. Big Mama's going, love you, Larry. Before we eat, 
I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Bro, they're so annoying, they annoy one another. Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, kids, look what Lee got working for you. A swing. I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Thanks, Lee. You're yeah. the best. Yeah. Larry saw their big, beautiful, white skin and thought to himself, well, these are good, kind-hearted folk, let me tell you. Classic. Classic Larald. One second. Hold on. Oh, shit. I got it. Oh, never mind. We're good. Oh. Why are the brothers so ugly? Inbreeding, bro. Inbreeding. Bro, for the record, that door is still open. So that perimeter is no longer safe. You can definitely tell they <laughs> built this thing themselves. They're storing gasoline all over the property. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. That thing keeps a fence electrified. I'm not done checking the whole area. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. For the people that they use as feed. Wait, is there a spot that I missed here? What's the light? Oh, fucking Laryl, dude. Now, who the. He's getting comfy, bro. He is so comfy here. Look at him. Look at how comfortable he is. He's like, yep, that's a racist gazebo. I love that. Lee, oh my God. I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring no, us to No, you haven't. Place? No, you haven't. When have you seen a guy take a fucking arrow and get through it? Like, he, he just kind of said that, but like, how? When have you seen guys go through worse? Fucking asshole. Shut up. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee, I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. And not giving my dad food. That was cold. I gave you food, dumbass. Hey. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. That sucks. You are a bad person. 
Does he treat you like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. Sexo. He just, he's got a lot of pain. Yeah, he's a lot of pain so of much being... And lost. A lot of pain of being white in an anti-white society. From his perspective, of course. Pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. That's a terrible reason, Lily. Not to get all fucking radlib on Twitter, but like... This is the type of conversation that you should be having at Thanksgiving with your racist ass family members, but y'all are not ready for that conversation. Think our little arrangement with them was a good idea? A little late to be asking that now, don't you think? Dad's right. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. I'm going to go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, yeah we know. And we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong. Oh my God, Larry! Bro, Larry, I swear to God, he only knows about my murder because he's he's trolling the fucking Fox News black crime tab. Okay, straight up, dude. Yeah, they don't like your kind poking about. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're going to need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Racist. Uh. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. If there's not Wait, enough what? room in the house for all of us. Wait, I why can't I open the door? Camp out open the door. What's in there? Not letting me open the door, sus. Lots of hay. Ugh, enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. That's crazy, I can't open the barn door and check it. Give it a little peeky peek. Go in the barn? I can't. It won't let me. I did, bro. It just said, oh, barn. Yeah, where's the fucking cow, bro? I try to open it. Ch chat, look. If there's not enough room in the house, that's what it does. Us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Chat is so silly sometimes. Like, you played this game 14 years ago, okay? Rory V, thank you for the 25. Get the subs. They look happy. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? This game All is right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try. Twelve years old, but it's feet. It's actually in 2010, even though it came out in 2012. <sighs> is there a QTE for this? How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? You got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Please put trigger warning in stream title. There's bad stuff in this game. Take a week off. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Trigger warning for the yeah, sex, though. I wish. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I don't think there is sexo in this. Yeah, I'm not sure when. 
one day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. I banned that chatter because they're not a gaming frog. Chat, you need to understand something. That chatter is not a gaming frog. He came in here as a politics frog and hit us with some politics shit while we're gaming. Disrupting the delicate balance, nay, the immaculate vibes of gaming. That's why they got banned. None of that political shit flies in here, okay? It's gaming time. Freaking nerd coming in here me like, Ugh. put a trigger warning, bro. It's literally like a 2010 game with cartoon graphics, okay? If you're getting triggered for this game, I don't know what to tell you, okay? Ooh, there's... Put a trigger warning on this game. There's scary stuff in this. Like, shut the fuck up, bitch. Yeah, the real scary stuff is every moment that I'm gaming is a moment that I'm not covering politics, and that's what you need a trigger warning for. That's what you actually came in here for. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Damn, bro. You pushed her like it's three times. Yeah. Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. Talk to Kenny. Oh, buddy. Hey. Haley. Found anything interesting? I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right, provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around, and let me know if you find anything else. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. I thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here? I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch them go hungry. You're with me on this, right? Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about these things. Wait, didn't I run the three-minute ad break already? Why are people sounded, trying to debate me? I did. I ran it, Chatters. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Yeah. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw <clears throat> what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. We think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Oh, I have some questions, bro. Yeah, but I guess that's what we gotta do. To find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. I vote a sunset designated hours Are for political cues. Now? Fuck yeah. no. I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. <sighs> Sorry. 
See anything? Not yet. Why am I yawning so much? God damn. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. You found it? See anybody? About to get ambushed again. Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Their food's still hot. Means they're either there, they haven't gone too far. Setting up for an ambush. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Still food in it. Just water. Empty. Nothing. Looks like they turned tail. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Never mind. My man's are the exact opposite. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Any mode is so funny. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Oh. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. The what do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Wait, no. Let me see it. No. Battery's dead, though. Oh. Good. What good. What else they got over here? Let's see Why if we is can that find good? anything useful and then get a move on. Why is that good? Why would you be excited that the fucking battery's dead? Yo, that's weird, bro. That's weird. That's weird as hell, bro. He's weird as hell. He's so inbred looking too. That's sus. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Bro, he sussed me out. He sussed me out big time, bro. Did he leave? The 
hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. If you tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. Oh, you shit. You don't know me. You steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down! You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. The fuck? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on, tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. How may I assist you? God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman! Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. <sighs> we got zombies coming in too, probably. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Take the crossbow, bro. Fucking finally smart enough to... Come on. No, I didn't shoot her. He did. I got real SA vibes underlying. Yes, I feel like she was, uh, she was trauma dumping. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Dunno. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Yeah, you could say that. They don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. So... You know what's for dinner? That fucking chair force vet. That's what. Check on Mark. I can't, bro. I want to, but I don't know where the fuck he is. 
Pardon me, Brenda. What's on your mind, Lee? How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. Oh, I've God. I've stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Okay, bro. Uh, not to be rude, ma'am. How come you're out here instead of, you know? <laughs> Get the cooking, woman. You wanna know why I'm not slaving away in the kitchen? Is that it? Uh, no, no. I didn't mean for it to sound like that. Oh, it's okay, darling. Got it slow cooking in the oven. Should be ready before too long. Slow cooking. Oh my god. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Slow cooking, Mark. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. It sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? <laughs> Means you can't trust them. Any of them. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Huh. That's... <laughs> they, they, they like their drugs out there. You can't trust them. What, what drugs, lady? It's a zombie apocalypse. Fuck you mean drug problem, bro. Wait, did I look at this toolbox? <laughs> it's a small toolbox. Brenda must use this thing for household repairs. Wait, open it, bro. Open it. Open it. Oh, shit. What's in here? Multi-tool. That should be handy. Yoink. I'm just going to borrow this for a second. Yoink. Copped it. Oh, that cow right there sleeping like Kyer. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Not red, don't care, is a red heifer. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. Aw. She's so cute. Is there anything in here that I can press? Nope. Mm. I want to play in the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. Look, you are so fucking okay. stupid, bro. How, I don't know how the hell. I don't know how the hell you turned out like this. Your mama smart, your daddy smart, you dumb as hell, son. I want to play in the hay. It's like, what the fuck? What do you mean? Empty. It's back there. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. 
Look, that guy Why with was... Kasha, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. It's probably Let's go daddy. Find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? Wait, no. why? Why would you say that? Why oh my god. That? Remember when I clocked it as Kenny? Remember when I clocked it as Kenny being like slightly racist but doesn't mean it and he's like a good guy overall this is that moment like he means well but he's like well you're black you know <laughs> your folk do that sort of thing you know urban oh my god oh my god oh my god kenny oh no it it'd be your own ones Oh no, Kenny, just because I'm a black man, huh? That's fucked up, Kenny. That's so fucked. He said urban. You are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Uh -huh. Sorry. That's good writing. <laughs> what? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver. You, you got no idea. Hey, uh, do me a favor. D don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Perfect. Mama gets nervous, huh? Distract Andy and to get him out of the barn. Mama no likey. Wait, what the Looks fuck's like in that one? Bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Wait, oh my god, it's not their clothes, bro. Chat, it is the clothes of their victims. One hundo P. It's a feeding trough. <laughs> nice. Thanks, man. I don't think they're eating zombies, chat. I think they're eating humans. Like, alive humans. Just some fence posts. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right. Good to hear. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm, <laughs> it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. <laughs> Kids. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while, raid our stuff, even with the fence. So, where do you keep the rest of the tools? Well, if you need something, just tell me what it is, and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. 
Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> That's it? Right. That's my All excuse? Right. Be right back, Doc. That's the excuse I have? That's terrible. That's not gonna fucking fly, bro. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Dude, I got jubated by an inbred hick, bro. That's like... Like, think about how fucking dumb I am. Of so, course they're yucking it up. Like yourself, run this whole place. Of course they're yucking it up, bro. He is so gross. Oh my god, I hope she eats him. Oh my god, Laryl, you fucking son of a bitch. Oh my god, at least someone's getting sexo out here. And it's fucking Larry. Of course, this game is so cooked. Oh, I managed just fine. Plus, I had my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Just two old races, bro. They're having the time of their fucking lives. You know what I'm saying? Lots of hay. Ugh. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. I forgot to give uh, Clem her hat, but before then, I also have to figure out how to get this guy. Wait, doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Bro, they are hiding something, but I don't know. Maybe it's not that big of a deal. Honestly, I don't know. I'm beginning to feel like... I'm going to feel like she might not be so off base on this. You know what I mean? <laughs> They're into anime. Yeah, dude, that's, that's what it is, bro. Power switch. I mean, if I, if I turn this off, like, oh, wait. No, not done yet. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something I should have fucking opened the brain. engine. I fucking should have opened the engine in the thing. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. It's crazy that I'm using the multi-purpose. Bro, there ain't no way I'm fucking this thing Looks up, like dude. This is gonna protect us. Uh, what you call it? Um Ow, damn it! The thing is moving fast. I don't want to fucking break it permanently. I want to push the power switch. Will I have time to push the power switch and then fucking, uh, and then pull it out? That thing is on too tight for my bare hands.
There, that should do it. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. Well, time to get back in there. Freaking frack, baby. Freaking frack. You know what it is. You know how it goes, folks. It's also so dumb that, like... There's a baby in there? Careful. Don't spook her. Oh. Hey. Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Ah, but you go on ahead. She looks skinny. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come God, on. Don't God make the children wait. It. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Screws holding what? it to the door. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Am I doing the wrong thing? Lock picking lawyer time, baby. Bro, that's just the cow murder room. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? You call me boy? Dinner time. What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. They're the ones who had the bear trap, by the way. One hundo P. And you don't need... You don't need a fucking bear trap with no exit latch if you're trying to catch animals. <laughs> oh, Brisket! You wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. us. We had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Oh, my God. Bro. Bro, it's Mark. Mark is what's for dinner. Oh, my God. We're eating Mark. Oh, my God. It's a setup. We are eating, Mark. I can't eat the food here, bro. Oh, Mark, it's what's for dinner. Oh, Marky Mark, dude. Oh, boy.
Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Danny's baseball trophy. Mm. Seems like it's been years since kids were playing sports for fun. And his college degree. These boys aren't stupid. Somebody woke up. Look at this. Somebody woke up. Hello. I have to pee again. This dairy must have meant a lot to them before the walkers destroyed everything. High school diploma. What do you mean clipped? Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Yeah, I'm going upstairs to see if fucking Mark is alive, bro. Come on now. Was it Mark Cuttery board? The hell's in there? Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. Oh my God! Dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff. Oh my God! They keep them alive to eat them. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. They either Most keeping the dad alive, they're either keeping the dad alive, chat, or they're keeping the people that they eat alive so that they don't turn Dennis. into zombies. Smart. <clears throat> what do they need so much morphine for? Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. I Are you keeping them alive so they can eat them piece by piece, what would bro? Dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff. Straight up. Huh, where is that cord going? I'm, oh my god, I'm losing my mind, bro. Is that blood? It's fresh. Where Where's Mark? Mark. Thought Brenda said he was up here resting. Uh, farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. That's, that's there's a room behind that for sure. 
farm books. There's a room books. behind that for sure. The ordinary here. That's where Marg is. One hundo p. There's a room behind this fucking thing. You can kind of tell the bookshelf looks all out of whack. I probably shouldn't be plugging this in, but fuck it. What the hell? Told you. Fucking called it, dude. That's gonna make a lot of noise, though. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I don't know if I want to know what's in there, bro. That's Mark. That's the butcher station. Mark. What the hell happened? Can I just say I fucking called it from a mile away, bro? Oh my god, my survival instincts are out of control right now. It's crazy. Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. Get the Clementine before she eats. Don't eat that! Uh, huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Oh, oh Doug's going to town. Down, this Doug's lady going to town, dude. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? That's ridiculous. Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Duck's eating good, what? bro. I was eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. Oh my gosh, it's she's how rationalizing I was it. And how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck? your guns down! We're- Yeah, Larry, you fucking idiot. You dumb fuck. Fuck you, Larry. Yo, oh my god. Do I give them Larry? So much meat. Bro, take Larry. You can eat him all day. By the way, Duck, did Duck ever stop eating, bro? I feel like he's still eating. <laughs> Duck's still in the corner like, I don't give a fuck. This shit's tasty. <laughs> He's got a he's got a taste for it, bro. He's developed a taste for it, bro. Yo, keep Duck too. Fuck it, dude. Keep Larry. Keep Duck. Okay, that shit's not gonna save you from the top of the hour ad break though, because at the top of the hour there's still a three minute ad break. Okay, that's right. These folks might be saved from the Georgian dairy farmers, cannibal dairy farmers. But let me tell you, you're not gonna be saved. By the time of the hour ad break, you need a three-minute subscription or five-dollar subscription for the three-minute ad break. Here's it. Here it is now.
I'm with her. Maya, you would not be able to eat the humans, okay? You talk a big game, but you would be getting eaten out here, okay? They would eat you first and your birds. First, they would come for your animals one by one, and then it would eat you and the birds. Walking you out of here! here my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. Lee? No, it Lee? won't. I don't know why I lied like that. Yeah! Oh, now, oh. Let go of her, you son of a bitch! The bandits are going to save us technically because they're raiding the home. Unless it's fucking Mark coming Please. downstairs. Someone. Ah. Oh. Oh, shit. oh, oh, what the fuck? Did we all die? What happened? Oh, Open hell no. Goddamn door. You can't keep us in here. Oh, no. You put me Open in a up. room with Laryl. Oh, that's, that's so that much worse. Just eat me, bro. Way out of here. Just eat me, bro. Don't fucking. No, just eat me. Just eat me. Just take me out. Chop me up. Eat me, bro. Do not lock me in a room with Larry. Please. Please, bro. Yo, shit. <laughs> fucking bastards. Open this door. God damn it. <laughs> Oh I my god. Oh, what a nightmare, dude. It it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, god damn it. If you hadn't dragged your feet. Come on, dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Oh my god, Larry. I fucking hate you so much, bro. I swear to god, you are the worst piece of shit of all time on my Your life, dude. Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Oh Open my. the fucking Dad, door! stop! God damn it! Come on! Try us out! Why can't he Come fucking on. die just now? Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention so I can fucking kill them. Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. <laughs> and you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. That's true, I do. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! No, you're not worth the energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. There's more of us on the way. Let us out now, if you want to live. Place. That is not gonna help. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. They're not gonna open the door! You think a fucking apocalypse They've got gives caught you and duck, right Lee! Those fuckers have my family! Me. I know! We're gonna get out of here and find them! Dad! This isn't helping! Hey, bread bastards! Could there be a hole behind these pallets? <laughs> no shot. That'd be way too easy, no bro. Such luck. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh, thank God. Easy. Oh, thank God. Now I have to kill him. Dad? Oh, now we have to kill him, bro. No. Dad, come on. Oh, now we Dad. have to kill him. Oh, no. Uh, we have to use breathing. the salt lick on his I head. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's bro. not dead. I like where Kenny's head's at. Kenny's thinking ahead. Kenny's thinking three steps ahead, bro. Everybody in the room's like, oh, finally. Now we get to kill him before he turns. Meanwhile, she's like, oh, my God. Oh, I'm going to save him. Shut the fuck up. Your dad is dead, okay? Start le learning. Learn how to live with him. You know what has to happen, Lee. 
Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. <laughs> Bro, he's not even minutes, dead yet. We're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Lily can still save him. I Let's wish see. she could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was Let's see, let's see, let's see. I gave him the benefit see. of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Let's see. Duck was I haven't given up on trying to hook up with Lily. I'm not going to lie. I mean, I fed her. Like, she'll remember, hopefully, that I didn't want to kill her dad. You know what I'm saying? Like, plus, remember, I do want to have sex with her while her dad is alive, so he kills himself. That's, like, way more. That's revenge. Bitten, but come on. We know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. I'm right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up. How do I even Come help on. her? Lee. I mean, I'll try to Is help. I'll try to help. All? No. No, I don't think so. Okay. Let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna what? turn! You're putting all of us at risk, you son of a Three, bitch! You're fucking four. worthless, Lee. He's alive! No! Kenny, what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. Bro, his mouth was moving. He was like... I can't tell if it, I love the way that they did that because you can't tell if his mouth was moving because he was turning or his mouth was moving because, or it, his mouth was moving because he was like getting back alive. It's crazy. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me. <laughs> Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. Can you gotta be strong. Can he save the Larry's about to say one last slur before he died? Yeah, that's why his mouth was moving. I could tell. right now i need you to be strong think about something else something hopeful like what someplace safe where no monsters can get you we're gonna get out right you found a way out i'm working on it <laughs> his brains <laughs> sorry Talk to Lily, see how, see what's up. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Kenny, he made a bad call. It was premature for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Bullshit. He cares about keeping it. Bro, she got daddy's fucking brains on her mouth. That shit is cold blooded. That's terrible. Safe. He doesn't give a shit about you and he me. He puts his family first, sure. Just like Larry did. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we've got to have the balls <laughs> to do the hard thing. See if Larry made it. Or at least one of us has got to. Someone say, who made this game possible? How about you fucking calm down, okay? This is why I love playing this game. So, Because it's so easily possible.
It's great. It's like I'm having a conversation with the chat while I'm playing. You know what I mean? It's awesome. It's great for me, chat. What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is there's safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. Wait, I want to keep talking to him. Look, if we're gonna survive this shit, we got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. Damn, my way or the highway, baby. Hell yeah, Kenny. Hell yeah, Kenny. Wait, what the fuck? Why can't I? Oh, here it is. <laughs> there ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. Oh, do they the take multi my multi-purpose? Wow, of they're so they dumb. Oh, they Maybe did take it. Fuck. We could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help, but a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. I was so stoked for a second. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. It's not coming off that way. Larry was talking about how he has 60 cents. Let's see. Let's see if he actually has 60 Sorry, cents. Larry. Nope. Not letting me check his body. Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Please, I need to be alone. Yeah, okay, God dude. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. Oh my God, I can't I wait think to. I may have found a way out of here. Oh my God, I, I can't wait to, to fucking me. loot Larry's dead body. Yo, that shit is great. Larry's mumbling the Shahada before dying. Allah did not want him to go to heaven. Move the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible <laughs> time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> Do what you have to do. That's crazy. Yo, we're looting Larry, oh, baby. Boy. Let's go. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? <laughs> That's insult to injury. I swear to God. Bro, he deserved Here it so go. much. He deserved worse, Two dude, honestly. And a die. He wasn't lying when he said he has 60 cents on him. Just got to remove these screws and get this unit off. Very low amount, very low amount of fucking. <laughs> this is the biggest screws of all Hurry time, the by up, the way. Lee. We don't have all day here. Man, I don't see you doing no work, dumb fuck. Shut your stupid ass country bumpkin ass up, Florida boy. All you've done is fucking murder people, okay? Well, there's our way out, Lee. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. Everybody chill out. Clementine needs to be protected at all You're costs, okay? Fine. Calm down. What do I do when I get out? She's the goat. See if you can get to She's the so other brave. Side She's awesome. I can't believe we're risking Clementine's precious life to save Duck's stupid ass, by the way. 
Katya carries her own weight, you know what I mean? Shut the fuck up. Shut the hell up, Kenny. Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Hey, we're good. Okay? Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Kenny, you dropped the fucking Mario ass Stay block here. on this man's head. Take care of Lily, okay? And now you're acting oh, brand new! Kenny got a taste of murder and literally, I swear to God, he's a different person now. He's changed. He's a changed man. He's like, yeah, I'm the wear. I'm the one wearing the pants around these parts. I told you there was something up with this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. That's useful weapon. Oh, what the fuck are in those jars, bro? Ugh, I think I'm gonna be sick. How did I not see those jars beforehand? <coughs> Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. You're bad, Dad. God, what's wrong with these people? You weren't in this part of the barn before? Yes, I was. I opened this part up. <clears throat> oh, hell yeah, dude. I'm getting... Oh. Wait, I can only take one fucking gun? Why can't you take both? Ooh. I think I should use the people's tool, comrade. Jesus, this is where they butcher people. Sick bastards, all of them. I kind of want to keep, I'm not going to lie, I kind of want to take the fucking taser because I want to keep them alive so I can torture them. You know what I mean? What? Am I crazy? They're eating people, chat. Come on now. Oh, I'm the crazy one because I want to fucking torture these fucking freaks. I wonder how long they've been chaining people up here. What my the bad, hell bro. Do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. Dumbass, get a weapon. Bro, Kenny, you are so dumb. I swear to God, you're the dumbest motherfucker alive. I swear to fucking God, bro. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place like you said. Well, quit sitting out in the rain like a damn weirdo. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep alive? Not the kid. Not enough meat on her to trade. Uh, oh, I know, Mabel. This is Take my a look favorite. Take through the cracks. Too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, 
<laughs> they never even look down. That's fucked Where up. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. I'll keep an eye on him. Be ready to act when I say. See what he's doing now. Bitch. Oh, that's it? That's all that did? Oh, fuck me, bro. Thank God for Lily. Kenny, you fucking L nerd. You didn't do shit. Also, the sickle was whack. I bet the fucking zapper would have clapped his ass immediately. Kenny, you fucking bitched out, bro. Not gonna lie. You had all the smoke for Larry, but turns out when it comes to this other dumb racist hick, you had, you had none of the smoke. Kenny's only got the smoke. Kaibaka, thank you for the 10th year one gift of subs. Kenny's only got fucking, Kenny's only got the smoke for, for killing Larry, dude, for killing Larry, who's on the ground. Your choice has affected Kenny, by the way. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, he felt bad. He didn't want to fucking save my life because I said, hey, maybe we shouldn't fucking bust this dude's skull in. Kenny apologists in the chat, dude. That's kind of fucked up. That's the first time. That's the first time I felt kind of some type of way about Kenny. Kenneled. No! Y'all love him because he's racist. I see how it is. You know, he's like, oh, you're urban. You see, you understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should what fucking the fuck? kill you right now. Mark never volunteered to be food. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Joe. That's what you think, bitch. Fuck out of here. Oh no, Clementine saw me kill the guy. Oh no. Bro, I'm cooked. I'm I, I've made every L choice so far. This chapter, episode two, has not been good for Lee. Okay. Lee has fucked up over and over again, taking L's left and right, dude. L for Lee, okay? Just go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Caked in blood. Caked in Pappy's blood. I'm a bad dad. Worst possible ending? Stop, bro. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Don't say that. Don't fucking say that, chat. Don't say that. shit oh my god my girl is here Lee ow shh is everyone okay you guys have been gone way too long they attacked us I knew it I told you we couldn't trust them shit 
How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Nice. That Yo, is she course. is locked up. Be careful. Bro, that is my girl, dude. Yes, Carly. Yes, girl. Always stay strapped. You know what it is. Always. She got the blicky on her. Oh, I got the 60 cents on me, so I'll, I guess I'll use the 60 cents. I'm going to take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Settle down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Why can we hear everything? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Yeah, it's me. Oh, God. Oh, oh that wasn't going to work. Yeah, it's me. Lee, hit back. Don't come in here. You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Let her go, Brenda. The fuck do I do now? Is she gonna kill Kaja? Please, please don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. What am I supposed to do? Stop right there! I mean it. Bro, this sucks. Think about what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Oh, there's a sombra above her. was obviously smart huh how did it come to this just stop Brenda please yeah keep going upstairs dumbass come on I don't want to kill you Lee this this dairy was your pride <laughs> you what don't you've have done to it you don't have the guts stop I mean it Kenny, you fucking suck, Who bro. Who the fuck you... do you people think you are? Look at what you've done. Calm down. Calm down. What for, huh? All we wanted was some goddamn gasoline. One more time. 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 Oh shit. The barrier is broken. The zombies are coming upon us. Oh my god. What do you do? Oh. Get the fuck up. No, no, no. What the fuck? I'm I'm doing it. Why isn't it working? Why isn't it working? What am I doing? I'm, I'm, I'm queuing it up. I'm queuing it up. What am I doing here? No, I'm going to get zapped. Lily. <laughs> Fuck you.
Clem is watching, bro. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. I can't keep punching him. Not with Clem watching. See? Don't worry. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit. It's over. Well, his mommy's Fuck gonna come you. out of the gate now. As soon as Dan and Mama get out here, you, you all fucked. They're dead, bro. They're both dead. What did you do? What the fuck did you do? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Oh! No! No! I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! Lee! Almost accidentally fucked it up. They're getting in! Lee! Let's go. Oh damn, mama's out. Mama's out. Thank God Kenny's still alive. Holy shit, bro. Jesus Christ. At first I thought, dude, this fucking, this story is crazy, dude. It is a crazy ass story. This is a dope game, actually. Oh no, she got the judgmentalized, dude. Clementine did not like what I had hey, to do. Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people for food? Yeah, yeah. and Clementine also, <laughs> also Duck was fucking hounding, dude. Yeah, we got to check up on Duck. I feel like he's got a taste of human flesh now. He's not going to stop. He's going to be a fucking... He's going to be the first example of a, of a human zombie. But... My boy was I feasting. <laughs> like, I can't leave her alone, Carly. <laughs> this fucking world, uh, It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Damn, bro, I thought you were going to be a journalist. Uh, what the fuck is this? How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's going to be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? Fine then, fine. I saved Duck on the farm and didn't save I didn't Sean. like any of those. I didn't like any of the options. They all sounded fucking insane. You destroyed this group, you murdered it? I kind of want to hang out with Kenny still. Am I cooked? Because like, honestly... It, it, fuck, don't tell me. Don't spoil it, but like, I still want to go with Kenny. Now I kill someone before I can put your little girl in danger, and I'm even more of a monster. I don't care. You do what you have to do. I'm gonna keep doing what needs to be done. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? Yes, they were bad men, Clementine. They killed Mark and they were going to kill all of us. They had to be stopped. Understand? Yes, I think so. 
Yes, murder hey, is good, Clementine. What's I'm a good up, dad. Guys? Zombers. Gotta be zombers. Sounds more like a car. Oh god, not more strangers. Banditos. Don't shoot. We're here to help. Oh my god. We fucking go, bro. Fuck's up with this camera. Oh, my man was drinking and driving. Dude. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Yeah, except there's someone. Not all of us. <sighs> it's a trap, bro. Come on. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. But what if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What I like that all of the adults are just straight lying to the children right now. Like, it very clearly is not an abandoned car. It... It was running a second ago. Like, oh yeah, it must be abandoned. Yeah, everybody always abandons their cars full of supplies. Like, Jesus Christ, dude. I have to pee. Also, I'm thinking maybe we pull this one. Maybe we pull this decision. Don't steal. Clementine wouldn't like it. Bro, I'm trying to survive here. It's survival of the fittest. But if it is someone's... Wait, do we pull it? Loot? Oh my god. 60% no. 40% yes. Alright, chap. Vote. Vote like your life depended on it. Vote like you're in there. What are people saying? All right, the nose are winning. All right, the nose have it. You're right. We shouldn't take this. 
What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. Clementine and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, what have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. I'm not gonna... <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, he's he's shot in the gut, bro. Like he needs stuff. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. <laughs> Doug hey, is looking there for some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought Doug they might look in your camcorder. Duck is looking for human meat. <laughs> Instead of chatter. Y'all are fucking... By the way, 56% of chat would die in the woods. Okay? Now we know. Myself included. I'm a sucker for democracy. <laughs> but like... We're all dying. Okay? Oh, we got our morals. Oh, yeah. Clementine is proud of us. But it's like... Honestly... Probably should have went for the food. I probably would have went for the food. If there wasn't a fucking electoral outcome here, here. you can have some too. For your walkie talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? I mean, yeah, that was pretty dumb. You were pretty dumb for fucking putting those batteries in wrong. Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Did they film their oh, gruesome shit. murders? How the fuck does she have the greatest audio of all time? That is the best microphone of all. I don't even think that technology exists. That's like some CIA shit, bro. That's not a shotgun mic. Chat, there is no shotgun mic on the planet that can pick up audio from that distance. Unless she bugged me. That's crazy. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, You're I'll safe. let you know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who took... Don't worry, little girl. And it's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. It's a parabolic attachment on a shotgun mic. That's crazy, dude. What a fucking banger. This place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases in there. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get them out of Tomorrow we do episode addicts. three, baby. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Maybe even episode four. Dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Wait, Sometimes trains work still? This is crazy. I'm the one keeping this group going. We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else. Episode three tomorrow, maybe even episode four, depending on how early I start. 
Chop Davis leg off, you and 44%. Shot Jolene, you and 61% of players had Danny Shooter. Pragmatism helped kill Larry, you and 51% of uh, players didn't help. <laughs> that one makes sense. Revenge, you and 61% of players didn't kill both brothers. Survival, stole food from the car, you and 49% of players didn't steal. It's all 50-50 because of replays. Yeah, I wonder what it was like when it first came out. But in any case, that was a banger, chat. I mean, what a banger. I really like the Walking Dead Telltale series. I don't know why it took me so goddamn long to get back to Telltale style gaming. Because this shit is so perfect, I think. For our style of streaming. Thank you.